evolution of King Kong. The King Kong and Godzilla movie came out not too long ago. And I know you guys liked it because I loved it. So that means you guys liked it, right? Uh, I, I would hope so. I really enjoyed that movie. And today we're reacting to the evolution of King Kong. And I already said that it's animated, blah, blah, blah. It's also by Teled Animated, which you guys seem to really like. I don't think I know the King Kong evolution at all. I think I've seen a few older versions of King Kong. I can't really remember. Now, if you guys uh, are new to the channel, if you haven't yet subscribed, please go down below and subscribe to support the channel. And also, whoever's watching this video, drop a like on it right now. And uh, let's get into this animation animated by Tell It Animated. Go check them out on YouTube. They're awesome. The, the evolution of King Kong. I can't get it all out today. Let's get into this. Okay, everybody tell them to do King, King Kong. Kong is the most recognizable ape in movie history. But what? just how has he evolved in his near century on film? From the 1930s the? to the modern day, let's take a look at the no, biggest no, 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 near no, no. There's never been a point in time where King Kong was that small. Look at the left. Look, there's a giant King Kong holding. Hold on, hold on, hold on. But just how has he evolved in the near century film? So I was thinking maybe King Kong was normal size at one point or something, which that wouldn't even make sense. But maybe as King Kong as a baby could have, but... No, I seen the Godzilla versus King Kong movie. This could be a spoiler, but I remember when he went onto that planet and it was a different area. He's not even from Earth. Film from the 1930s to the modern day. I don't think. Let's take a look at the Big Ape's evolution. Animated in his original film, King Kong has constantly shifting fur. 1933, Kong RKO. I have never even heard of that. He's 18 to 24 foot tall. Wait, 14 to 17 All over tons. His body, minus a hairless chest. He has a prominent brow, flared nostrils, and that is that is teeth. that is not a brow. That is not a brow. That is a big bulge in your a forehead. Chest. He has a prominent brow, flared nostrils, and sharp canine teeth. He also sometimes has a longer face and a more bare chest. And in super close-ups, his face appears whiter with smaller features. He's forced to become a theater attraction. Oh, uh, yeah. See, we all know that. We know about him being forced to become a theater attraction because they captured him. Was like, oh, my God, it's King Kong. And they're all taking pictures. However, I've seen the movie that they did this in, even though it probably didn't start in the movie it's just the story of it but in the movie that they told the story and he was in front of like everybody and he was being held up and uh, on something similar to this but this looks very small compared hey, to that snags his special lady friend only to be shot down from the empire state building in the sequel it's revealed kong had a son he's much smaller huh? has all white fur and a much happier face although to some Hold on. he's much smaller has all white fur and what all white fur King Kong's son? No way. Uh-uh. In a much happier face. Although to save the life of a shady movie producer, this ape sacrifices himself in flooding water. In King what? Kong vs. Godzilla, Kong has reddish fur. With okay, hold on. It says King Kong vs. What is second? There was a King Kong vs. King Kong versus Godzilla 1962. The new one that just came out was Godzilla versus Kong. I didn't call it King Kong versus Godzilla. Man, King Kongo, Kingu Kongu, KVG, 148 feet tall, 20,500 metric tons. That is a lot of weight. He's 150 feet patches on tall. each of his packs, prominent cheekbones, thick eyebrows, and is much taller than most iterations My of Kong. My God! He's apparently supercharged by lightning, which he uses to fight a radioactive... What? Nah, King Kong ain't got no lightning abilities! Monster, both tumbling into the ocean. The first animated series features a more quadrupedal standing Kong. Okay, so this may be correct, but I have never seen these King Kongs ever. Like, in the comments below, let me know. Have you ever seen a King Kong that looks like this? What is that? The King Kong Show. King Kong. Okay, his name is finally normal, but it says KKS on the right. And now he's 50 foot tall and only 100 tons. Along with brown fur and stylish hair. This ape also has a best friend, Bobby, the? with who he goes on adventures. Additionally, this show features the evil... What? What? What year was that? What year was that? Bobby. Standing Kong. 1966. 
this ape also has a best friend, Bobby, with whom he goes on adventures. Who's Additionally, Bobby? this show features the evil Mechanicon, a robotic Kong oh operated by the dastardly Doctor Who. In <laughs> King Kong Escapes, Kong is less than a Oh my gosh, see I'm over here reacting to this like, like something's wrong, but nothing's wrong. He's telling the evolution of King Kong and I'm just very lost by it because what I know by King Kong is not any of this. Half the size of his King Kong vs. Godzilla counterpart. His head is bigger, with larger facial features, and he has longer arms and shorter legs. This film also features its own Mechanicong. Oh my gosh, Mechanicong? Are you kidding me? Like Mecha Godzilla, but Mecha Kong? Powerful light bulb eyes and a utility belt full of grenades. Although the second version of him You've lacks the be belt, but does have a hypnotic light on his head to help him fight against the OG Kong. That would be a sick battle. The remake Kong has dark fur and skin, a small muzzle, look like zombie Kong, and noticeably human looking eyes. His face also occasionally looks unrecognizably round. This Kong is creepily attracted to his special lady friend, and when taken off this his is island, a story he is I know. forced to become a mascot for a greedy oil company. But he breaks free, scales the Twin Towers, and is shot down, presumably oh. killing him. But Okay, 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 let's go back a little bit, because you can see the size of him next to the free. helicopter. Scales the Twin Towers and is shot down. That makes sense. Him, but almost. No, almost, because the helicopters were like half his size. And I'm thinking helicopters are like a hundredth of his size or something. In the sequel, it's shown Kong is being kept alive in a coma. This what? film also introduces a more red-furred Lady Kong, who is used to give oh, Kong a no. blood Oh, Kong. King Kong gets a girlfriend? You... What? Transfusion, allowing an artificial heart to be placed inside of him. This time, Kong is a little taller, has longer hair, a more pronounced chest, a longer face, and his eyes look less human. He and Lady Kong run off together. Oh no, they gave them an artificial heart, and now they're running off because they're in love. Only for the military to shoot him down. Again! He passes, he's able to see his just-born offspring, Little Kong. The Mighty Kong features another cartoon Kong with a bulging torso, rounded muzzle, and despite the poster sh How do you even have a Mighty Kong? Like, King Kong is already mighty. I'm not mad at Tell It Animated at all. I'm mad at how this is going down. The evolution of King Kong is so weird. Knowing him as all brown, this Kong has gray skin and dark fur. Like usual, this Kong falls from the tallest building in New York, but this time he gets to survive how? this fall. Kong in the animated series features a oh, muscular that Kong build. looks crazy. 2001, that looks like a weird Hulk. 40 foot tall, 80 tons. Longer arms what the? and a tiny head. Although in his final outing, his look would be more streamlined with a larger head. Notably, this Kong can meld minds with his human brother, which boosts his intelligence and allows him to double in. See, that wasn't even that long ago, but I've never seen that one. Melt Mines, Size. he's a, he's the a wizard. The 2005 King Kong looks largely like a silverback gorilla. Mm. That one right there makes sense. I don't know what other, the other stuff is, but this one is the one that Noticeable makes sense. scars and large protruding teeth. This Kong is easily entertained, but much like his original counterpart, is no match for bullets. And a 14 This one makes sense. Ball. Kong, King of the Apes, features a more stylized young Kong, who then grows into an adult. In the second season, he's given a slight redesign with pinker skin. This Kong wears Don't laser smile. proof arm bracers and a- That's Donkey Kong, man! That's Donkey Kong. It's not King Kong. Look at the things around. Occasionally rides a giant jetpack. What is In going on? Kong's what is going on? Kong has great posture. His Here we go. Okay, so the, the original King Kong that I ever seen was way back. And I think it was the one they just went through, but not the one with the jetpack. That didn't even make any sense. But now we're on 2017 Kong Skull Island, which this one is great. Fur is light brown, and he has prominent scarring on his chest. This light Kong brown. defends his island's visitors from his unruly neighbors. In the follow-up, Kong is much larger, has darker fur, and a salt and pepper beard. He also now yields a fancy dorsal fin. Ah, now this is looking correct. An axe to help him face off against the king of the monsters, only to team up and take down an even greater threat, proving once and for all that Kong really is the king of the apes. Absolutely, he's called King Kong, duh! But... You know what? The evolution of King Kong really has got me super messed up because it was super weird and I didn't like it. Okay? I mean, I like I love King Kong, but I didn't like how there were so many weird spots. It was like Hulk 
with King Kong mixed kind of thing. But if you guys did enjoy this video, please drop that like. Subscribe to the Queen Kingdom down below, baby. And I don't really have an outro, so peace.